okay everyone so in this video what we are going to learn or what we are going to do is basically uh, taking the data that we have in our daily summary uh, data import staging table and transfer it into our COVID-19 cases table so we are going to create a transform map for that using that transform map we are going to do this operation okay so let's create our transform map so look for transform app here click on create and you will have this page here and i'm going to give a clear title a clear, clear name sorry daily summary data import transform map this is the name of my transform app here and then the source table is going to be daily summary data import table and then the target table it's our covid19 cases table so let's put the order to 200 because this is my second transform map click on submit Okay, and then click on auto map matching fields. It's going to map automatically all the fields that I have in my source table to the fields that I have in my target table. Okay, so let's look at the U underscore date here. This field and see the format. It is not the same format that we have in our JSON response. Okay, so we should work a little bit with the format. We should change the format there in order to have properly the date in our uh, target table so this is the format that we should use so we should modify a little bit and then we are going to have uh, properly our date inserted in the table so we have done with that and let's check one more time if it is okay great so now let's uh, run the transform app I'm gonna reload quickly the the form here and then click on transform Okay, so make sure that you have the right transform app selected here. Click on transform. So we are running. Um, so we are transferring the data to our target table now. It is done. We have only few records, around 250 records, and for for today. And then click on one record here, for example. So you have the result for Afghanistan. So this is basically uh, we have done pretty much with the. Uh, Putting the data into our target table and we can check in the COVID-19 table for example so we have the data for today okay so yeah so the next thing what we are going to do basically is uh, how to automate this process how to take the data automatically from the response and then put it in this in, into this table okay so we are going to create a schedule import thank you for watching